trying to let you in Late nights, you've been deceiving Perception changed all quick in my eyes And I don't know if it's just right, no Got a lot of secrets in your life, yeah. Got a lot of secrets in your life, yeah. You got a lot of secrets in your life, yeah. You got a lot of secrets, secrets Oh, hey there. Um, welcome to the Prime Show, episode number 20. Well, I kind of got the PS Vita. Um, it's been a long time ago. So it was released on, on 2012. They announced they're making a, a first ever the PlayStation Portable from PSP converted to a PS Vita. So uh, that was a long time. And it's been uh, four years before they decided to stop making the PS Vita games and the console itself, it's time to shut the PS Vita down. Yep, they did they discontinue through to 2016. And now they focus on PlayStation 4 and place and PlayStation 3. Yeah. PlayStation 3 is is gone and so is PS Vita. The only remain is the PS4 is still left on. But we're still waiting for the PlayStation 5 will it will be revealed on holiday season. Maybe in November will be in revealed in June 2020. Let's hope so. Hi everybody and I'm Carbat Angerman, host and founder of the Prime Show, the former of YouTube and we're in the soy we're in the soy fire on on channel so uh glad here to join us for for a saturday weekend because um the next saturday show will be a big two-hour event so stick around before the end of the show so um this is a PS Vita White. So that was a long time ago before they stopped making more, stopped making this PS Vita operating stuff anymore. Anyways, um, let's get to the news update, ladies and gentlemen. This regarding on the on the week of April twenty sixth through May first, it was announced Sasquatch will begin. Phase one of its reopenings starting May 4th with other provinces committing in the weeks after. Canadians can be hopeful by the end of June, many places will have been reopened. Yes, there will be a fiscal distancing measures put into the place, but they will still in back in business. Hopefully, the economy will get it fixed back as soon as possible but until June 2020 when summer. Yeah, when the summer hits, more degrees, the then the, to flat the curve is going down. Then the core virus will be officially dead. And now all around the world trying to clean this clean this mess up until when the core virus is buried. So Sasquashing in Sasquashin in Canada. The yeah, they're gonna be opening, including the Quebec. They're gonna reopen the some of non-essential and essential business to re to restructure the, the economy and company. And one of the stores, they're about to they're about to start over and try get as much as possible to fix to fix the economy after the <coughs> excuse me after the disaster of the coronavirus all stores have been shut down in temporarily until further notice that is kind of a big 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 shock and big 
fear. Yeah, that's got a lot of fear through their minds. That this is a reality. Fact is a reality that comes to happen. So many coronavirus deaths and many people have been recovered from their coronavirus COVID-19 all around the world. I, yeah, I hope it gets to 1 million recover. But the coronavirus cases hits to 3 million right now. And now deaths like 230,000 people have died from COVID-19. <sighs> oh boy, this is gonna hit hard. So even badly, just like Donald Trump who don't give a crap about that. Giving the people in the United States of America versus paychecks, loans, everything. And Donald Trump can't do their job. Wow. Wow, Donald. Anyways, um, time for a sports update, ladies and gentlemen. And the Major League Baseball, yes. Um, I think Ken Wilson thought in athletics was reported on, on Tuesday, May, not May, uh, April 20th, 2020. It will resume that Major League Baseball will continue with 800 games starting July 2020. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, they're going to open... Their stadium, baseball, is, is going to come back in July 2020 when this core virus is over. This pandemic core virus all around the world is affecting, panicking, will be all over until the core virus is dead. So, good job, Ken Watson thought. He, he's known from Fox all the time, we're playing on, on the Fox Sports for the Major League Baseball, and uh, he's appeared in, in, a, in a postseason and World Series all the time. So, um, it will resume July 2020 for the Major League Baseball's regular season continues with 80 games. Yeah, 162 games is going to be minus due to the core virus, and now it's, it's going to be 80 games from July to October for postseason baseball. <sighs> Let's hope to bring the players back to the, to the grounds in a, into a dirt to play ball for the regular season 2020 season of Major League Baseball. Welcome back to the to the majors. Welcome back to the to the umpires who have who have recovered or came back from laying off. And now and now um, Joe West, Angel Hernandez, yeah they're gonna return and many umpires will return in July. So Umpires agree with that. They will not. They will not come to May, April. Uh uh. No way. They're gonna start June or July. Yeah. Let's hope for July when the time comes. Then the baseball season is officially back with 800 games until road to the postseason of who's going to race for the, for the wild card pennant or, or nationally Amer or American League pennant. AOS, AO East, AO Central, same with NL. I predicted if the Dodgers can win again for the National League champions for the NL West in 2020. 
you got lots of more players, more overpowers. Don't do it yet. I hope they can outlast the Houston Astros. That way, Astros will not get into the World Series and the postseason will be out thanks to the cheaters, what they did in 2017. Astros versus Los Angeles Dodgers in the World Series. That the Los Angeles Dodgers cost their loss by the Astros. So, let's hope in July 2020 for Major League Baseball. On the second one, um, you saw on the footage that you are about to see is a brand new in Arlington, Texas. Um, the, after the Globe Live Park is gonna shut down and move to a new stadium called Globe Live Field. You see that? You see that? Take a look. Look at that. Beauty, beautiful seats. There are so many high seats all the way to the right field. And you can see all the billboards on the screen and the roof. It, God, it looks amazing. So despite what the core virus pandemic had appeared, so that they're empty and there are still boring and empty that there's nothing except for the workers are appeared in this school blood field, this new ballpark for Texas Rangers. Yup, they've been way off and they sent home due to core virus. Uh, that sucks and but it's very cool with that look from the concept to an actual look of the globe life field was approved by the city of Arlington in Texas. That idea project, it worked. So, LV decided to delay this coronavirus pandemic 2020 baseball season with teams club together in different regions. You heard, same with Ken Russell's art, they're going to be back on July 20th with the regular season Major League Baseball with 80 games and then head into the postseason of who's going to win. Who's going to win the championship for 2020 World Series and the National League and the postseason pennants. It's kind of very hard to sit down and get close. Anyways, um, that was the sports update. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to take a commercial break. Right after this break is the Strong Together have been starstruck. And also, the YouTube will be adding a free digital stream featuring with Toronto Film Festival and so many film festivals all around this country is due to the COVID virus are being canceled through outside this season. That details when we come back right here on TPS with K on Story 5. Don't go anywhere, hurry back. Welcome back to TPS with K on Soyfire Social Distancing Edition. Glad to glad to turn your content on your computer, laptop, tablets, phones that you are watching on YouTube and Soyfire that we're in the entertainment update 
on April 27, 2020, the YouTube will begin free digital film festival due to the coronavirus have been canceled throughout how through outside of the country will be in the YouTube free live stream with Toronto Film Festival, yeah Toronto International Film Festival, Cannes Film Festival, Sundance, Tribeca and Venice Film Festival. So many 20 film events all around the world will be on YouTube live stream in a digital film that due to the cancellation of the season now they're about to watch on YouTube and so many actors, celebrities, yes are going to be held on 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 live stream for the film festival and what the upcoming movie for the film festival that has going to happen in this year 2020 yeah and i give uh all the credits for doing the right thing to put it on free digital film on the live stream for on YouTube with 20 film festivals after the cancellation due to the core virus it's a good thing to get more viewers to watch the film festival this entire event oh boy so on the second one this Stronger Together. Have you ever enjoyed um, Stronger Together on CTV Global, CBC, and CDTV? Well, I did not. I did not see on Sunday edition of the home concert and so many Canadian music and actors. I mean, my God. They they shook they shook into a raise of six million in donations for food banks, Canada, that the profit organization would would reach by ten million by the end of the week, and also for <coughs> oof got too much knees there's there's no dust and it's just a just a something. A flu, like a blood flu or cold flu. Where are we? Um, the one hour, 30 minute program with numbers of A-list performers and celebrities broadcast on Sunday night with dozens of television stations. Yeah. I can tell. They, um... They've been worked so hard on the non-essential businesses who fight and doing their doing their jobs to keep them open for doing uh, such hard work. Get when you're in the hospital, people have been got by COVID-19. Many nurses, all and associations across from the hospital doing they can in the best part to save their lives from from preventing a death of COVID-19 and businesses employers supervisors management all around in the company in Canada worked so hard and they could have done it before during the COVID-19 in the coronavirus pandemic. Some people have been laid off, some people have not been laid off and forced to work to get the job done. 
And I'm pleased to say, God bless you all, and God bless you for all the hard work to restruct the company during, due to the core virus. This fight will never end. And I'm proud to each and every one of you and all around to YouTube viewers in Canada and in the United States and in North America, you made, you made your decision that you put on the line to each and every one of you did succeed to fight this COVID-19. Trying to slow down so I can get get that straight forward. Anyways, um that was the entertainment update. The the stronger together and the YouTube will be held on one of the film festivals, Twamp. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I guess that is it. That's the end of episode 20. And and see you on the next Saturday show for our two-hour special edition. Because on the next Saturday show, be prepared for our two our special edition celebration that has since August 2015 we ever did our first our first video upload when I played a Grand Theft Auto and also when we began on season one to on on August to on January 2017. No, it is January. It's it is uh. January is is on uh um what was I uh sorry yeah it starts on 2016 on January or maybe January in January 2017 no it is January 2016 where well, we start on on upstairs right cross into my brother Kojo's room when I start broadcast to you on YouTube for four years and now being moved now I've been moved to Storyfire. This will be a 100 episode celebration. So stay tuned because we are about to show you the highlights for all the past 100 episodes in the past years. All the best moments, all the best all the best highlights of the commercials all and of all time in the past throughout this history of New Spark 3 channel as known the Prime Show. So make sure to stay tuned for the next Saturday show with two hour special edition celebration event is coming up. Also stay tuned. Chad McAlser, Rebecca, with two new videos is next on YouTube. I'm about to say, we'll see you on the next Saturday show for 100 episode salvation. Make sure, keep that calendar when I'm gonna be landing on the Saturday. Maybe it could be end of the May, or it could be beginning of the May of the month. So, Keep staying updated when it lands on the 100th episode of the Prime Show Salvation with Two Hours is coming very soon. Watch the calendar as I'm about to land very soon. You know the time, what comes next. Have a great weekend and my moment 
is waiting until I been I have been to be led where I'm about to head Bye bye, buddy. Have a great weekend. And this is Aspen News from our great channel. As the Prime Show on that app, Adjumet, right here on YouTube and Story Fire.